I, Jerry, summon thee, great King Gob, Lord of the Gnomes and Hoarder of Doubloons. Come to me, great King Gob, and do my bidding. Gob? Is that really you? G Gob? Do you seriously you think Gob? would show up for just any human with a book and some candles, really? Wait, my name is Howard, man. Howard? Uh, you, you're not Gob? Did you not hear me the first time, you idiot? <sighs> well, I mean, what about the treasure? Did, did I do something wrong? Look, son, look here. Gob has had it up to here, like, like here, with all of you amateur warlocks trying to Evoke his holy presence for no reason other than your desire to steal all of our doubloons. So, like, what am I supposed to do now? Well, uh, uh, there's two options. I could go back underground and leave you to your own miserable existence alone. Or I could stick around and have myself a little fun. Because it has been 700 years since I've seen the light of the sunrise, and I hear it still looks pretty cool. Yeah, um, can you not just go somewhere else? Okay, I'm going to be straight with you. The reason that God sent me is because I, I don't have anything better to do. I personally have no doubloons. Uh, my, my wife took all my gnome money in, in gnome divorce court. And I need somewhere to stay and get back on my feet. So, if you help me, I'll oh. reward you handsomely. No, oh, um, I mean, the guest room's over there, but uh, you can have it, I guess. Thank you, sir. Your kindness will not be forgotten. Yeah. You call this a residence. You have like no dirt on your body. You know, in in a gnome house, this would be disgusting. I'm making this house a home. So, Jerry. I I understand, you know, just putting your dirt all over my floor. Totally fine. Thanks for asking. Oh, you're welcome. It's great. Oh yeah, yeah, keep doing that. I'll be back in a couple hours. I've got to go. Okay, let's go. Uh, no, no, you're you're not coming with me. I'm I'm meeting someone. Ooh, that sounds fun. I, I like meeting people. I love. I'm really fun at parties. People love me. You know, King Hrothgar's fourteen hundred birthday party. Sloshed on me, Wonderwall karaoke. Need I say more? No, uh, you're just. I'm telling you, you're not coming with me. <laughs> Fine. Okay, whatever. Like, I'm, that's who I am. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Terry? You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. It's just... Uh... Well, well, well. Fancy seeing you here, Jerry. So this is what was so fucking important that you had to leave me this morning alone in your house with no dirt on the floor. See, uh, that's just my roommate. His name's not really yeah. He's on his way out, right? Uh, no. Actually, no. I'd like to stay, uh, talk to this young lady some more. Meet her, you know, uh... Is this, like, a prank? No, no, no. He's on his way out. What are you, fucking stupid? I don't want to leave. Man, you reminded me of my gnome ex-wife. Jerry, you obviously don't take this seriously. I'm out. Wait, no, no, please, come back. Dude! What the fuck? <sighs> what was that? Um, so I, I think humans call it like wing mining. Hmm. And uh, you're welcome because that went super well. Super well, huh? 
super well. She ran away because of you. Okay, so what you got to understand? What you got? Check this. Gnome courting mm -hmm. is all about playing hard to get. Oh, I remember when I was courting my ex-wife. You know, mm -hmm. I uh... ex-wife, huh? I can see why she was your ex-wife. Oh, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. You, you want to go there? Yeah. Want to go there? Let's talk about that woman. Mm -hmm. How long have you been like lusting after her mm -hmm. without doing? Anything about it. You did not go after her. Even when she left today, you just said, like, oh no. You don't know shit about gnomes, you fucking weirdo. You, oh, weirdo. You want to talk about being a weirdo? You put dirt all over my floor. Uh, yeah, but you don't own a toaster, so it's basically as weird. Why would I need a toaster when all you cook is rocks? You know what? I'm done with you. Take your fucking dirt and get out of my goddamn house, okay? Fine! Today is gonna be the day that they're gonna throw it back to you By now you should have somehow realized what you gotta do I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now Backbeat, the word is on the street that the fire in your heart is out Sure, you've heard it all before, but you never really had a doubt. I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now. And all the roads we have to walk are winding. Hello, Jerry. I'm so sorry. I I never meant to leave you. You're my best friend. <laughs> Congratulations, guy! Jenny, you passed my test! It is I, Gob, King of the Noobs! What? Yeah, has been me the whole time. <laughs> gotcha. Wow, uh... Okay, bye. Wait, what? Where are you going? Look. Jerry, I've greatly enjoyed our time together, but I must return to rule over the gnomes. No, yeah. but please, don't leave. I'll have nothing. Wrong! You will have everything you need because you have learned the value of a good friend. Plus, I will begrudgingly grant you an endowment of gnome doubloons. Look, guy, Jerry. You've inspired me to reconnect with my gnome ex-wife. And I think, personally, you should go forth. Go after that woman, that girl that I scared away. Just fucking throw me under the bus. Just like, that guy's a weirdo. He is gone. He's not around anymore. The dirt's off the floor. It's great. It's great. We're okay. You gonna do that? I'll do it. I'll do it. Thank go. Set forth. Godspeed, Jerry. Goodbye friend.